Hi, my name is Ravi Sagar. In this video, I will talk about five important languages for DevOps you should know. The first language is Bash, which is one of the most important language. It is the first choice for any Linux or Unix based administration. The syntax of Bash is very simple. You can use it for mostly automating activities and shell scripting should be one of your topmost priority if you want to move to DevOps domain. The second language is Perl, which is uh, again very important language in the DevOps circle. It is actually quite important because it is almost available in every system. And one of the best part of using Perl is that it has a huge library. And it can be used for not only low level applications, but also high level applications. And if you take a look at various DevOps based job openings, you will find that they mention Perl as the mandatory skill. The third language is Python, which is uh, again very important. And it is actually an all purpose language for infrastructure. It is used in OpenStack and various cloud based applications. And Python can also be used for developing web apps. The next language is Ruby, which is uh, again important, but not like uh, Python and uh, shell scripting but it is always good to know some additional languages like ruby because if you are working on puppet or chef you might need to know ruby as well and the good thing is that ruby is not difficult to learn at all it is quite easy and just like python ruby is also very popular because there are some frameworks like ruby on rails which is based on ruby and the last language is go which is uh, again important language to learn when it, when it comes to DevOps, but it is something that you should probably consider after you have mastered the Python or Ruby, or maybe once you are very much comfortable with shell scripting. So Go should be in your list, but take a look at those other languages that are really, really important. But just to let you know, Go was developed by Google and uh, it is mostly suitable for network and server based applications. And one of the most important usage of Go is to do some automation, of course, but uh, whenever you need some performance, then Go is a very suitable language. And finally, I want to mention JavaScript. Yes, it can be a surprise because uh, when it comes to JavaScript, you will be wondering why JavaScript because it is usually mostly for web-based applications, but it has become quite important nowadays. If you know JavaScript, it will be like a, like a bonus language that you can add to your skill set. Because JavaScript is also, again, very popular language for web-based applications. There are a lot of frameworks like Angular, React, and Node that actually uses JavaScript. So if you know JavaScript, it will actually be very beneficial where you are working on doing some automation and if the company where you're working or maybe you know if you're applying for a job and if they have some applications that are based on these frameworks which are actually quite popular nowadays then having this knowledge will definitely be very useful i hope this video was useful thank you very much